Today I'm going to show you a hazy IPA beer under the microscope. I poured some into a glass jar, then got a sample of the foam at the top and some samples of the liquid at the bottom. Let's take a look. Most beers, including IPAs, go through a filtration process to get out any of the extra unwanted debris. When a beer is hazy, it usually just means that the stuff that is typically filtered out is left inside the drink, which gives them their name and their cloudiness. Most of the sediments that you'll see floating around inside are primarily yeast and some protein particles. The yeast will typically lie at the the bottom of the bottle, but once poured, the yeast and other debris will resuspend in the drink, giving it a cloudy appearance. You can actually see some of the vacuoles inside of the yeast cells here, along with a bunch of other particles floating in the background. These particles may look like they're moving, but this is just a phenomenon called Brownian motion, which is basically big particles moved around by smaller particles that are suspended in a liquid or a gas. I also measured some of the yeast cells, and most seem to be 7 to 8 microns in length. As always, thanks for watching and follow and like for more microscope.